Now I cut that one short. Take this flash off. I cut that one short, but uh, usually do 10 on each leg because I already did it already. Um, you want to be on your toes, so you're really working on flexibility. Uh, how far you can lift your leg, it helps out with the jogging, running, take wider stances. You, uh, it's easier to cover long distances, easy. So you'll cover the same distance, but your, your legs will feel less tired. It also works on staying on your toes so you can have softer steps so you exert less energy on your feet. So you do um, 10 on each leg basically um, for three sets. Uh, it works, but the thing is, as you lift your leg as high as you can go, you want to lift it as far up the steps as possible. It works inside the legs. It's going to stretch the growing. On top of that, your toe is going to be flexed because you're on your toes, and that's going to work your glutes and the hamstrings. So you're not only getting a wider stride, but you're also uh, getting a little leg workout in too to help out with running because when you run, you usually get tired, and this prevents, helps you run stronger. It makes your body less tired. Um, so that's it for this one. Um, and then the next one are going to be one-legged hops all the way up, all the way down, three sets of ten. Let me show you that. I'm doing something. I'm working out. That I have to do stuff to work on computers. So he did the first two. You saw they did one hops, one hands, stretches, workout. For the final one, we have uh, like run ups, kind of like you do in the stadium, two feet on each step. The difference is you want to switch each foot, and you're going to do this four times. So you're going to start with the right foot. So basically, I'll explain it. I like it because it's going to get you tired, it's going to give you coordination. It's going to work your, all of your leg muscles. Um, basically, you go up one step, you come back down right foot. You go up two steps left foot, you come back down. You go up three steps right foot, you come back down. You go up four steps with the left foot, you come back all the way up to ten and down. And you want to do it twice on each side because you want to start with the left foot first twice. Then you're going to start with the right foot first twice. But you want to switch foot every single up and down. So you go up seven, you come down, you switch foot, then you go up eight. So not only do you switch feet, but you want to go up an extra step until you get to 10. But don't worry, you don't have to count down until you don't have to go to 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. It's a little bit ridiculous. So I'll show you right now. And then in between each stop, you do 20 jumping jacks. That's for the whole workout.
<sighs> That's your at home workout. <sighs> it's good, it's about 35 minutes. That's your at home workout before I cut off my space. I'm gonna go fast. Don't forget to subscribe right down there. Like it and comment, share it with your friends. More videos coming soon. Thanks for watching.